So continuing with my uh, videos on flatting tips, I wanted to do a quick demonstration on a technique that you could use to speed up the flatting process. So I'm going to use this panel as an example of how to do that. All right, first thing I want to do, I've already set this up for flat, so there's a line art channel. I'm going to hold down Command and click on the line art channel to select it. Now, as I mentioned in the uh, the first flatting uh, demo, that you never want the colors to line up with the edge of the blacks. You want, you know, so you want to. Uh, have the you know the edge of your colors to be a few pixels underneath the blacks. So I am going to go down to select, m modify, contract, and I am going to contract by three pixels. And then from there, I'm going to do, I am going to go down. I'm going to pick this flat gray, and I am going to fill and deselect and I'm going to turn off the line art channel to show you what I did. So now you can see there is a slightly thinner line underneath the uh, the line art. And what this allows us to do then is okay, I'm going to select the wand tool, put it on contiguous, and as you can see, now I can easily select shapes. Now, of course, you know, I could go through and just by selecting shapes, fill in these shapes really fast with a color. However, um, I don't recommend this, doing this directly this way, because I turn up the line art channel again. Uh, you'll notice, like here, there's still the gray um, within the face, the gray lines within the face. Also, you know, over here, because there's hatching, we missed some areas with white. So, what we really, um, we don't really want to, so basically, we don't, really don't want to leave the gray underneath it, because most colorists, I know I wouldn't, um, most colorists wouldn't like uh, getting flats like this. So, I'm going to go back a few steps. And I am going to use the wand tool. I'm just going to quickly wand. Actually, I don't need to do that. I could do that. So quickly wand around the face. And then, or not wand tool, lasso tool, sorry. Um, now I'm using the wand tool. And I am going to deselect the areas around the face and in the eyes. And now I'll fill it in with the base flesh tone. Now go in to the eyes, put in an eye tone, and then all right, the hat band. And then I'm going to lasso really fast around the glove here. Both of them, I'll make both of these a purple. Oops, a purple. And then around the hat, deselect all that, and now I fill in with that green. And again, underneath the dialog, I don't want any gray, so I'm just going to fill that in with white. I'll just select all, deselect the gutter. I'm going to turn contiguous back off, deselect all the color, turn back on, deselect the. Oh, I want to make. Oop. What did I do? Oh. I see what I did. That's open. All right, so let's try it this way. Select all, deselect all the colors. Boom. I'm going to have to do this one manually. And 
then deselect the gutter and pick a background color fill in the background all right there we go now the flats on this panel is done and if I turn on off the line art you can see there is little to no gray left in the lines which is pretty much how you want it and in fact a little gray around the word balloon I can easily just go in here turn that white there now there's no gray at all and you know this is how you want the fl you know the finished flats to look this is perfectly usable and most colors would be happy to get it and it's a little faster now uh, this technique works best when you have more simple like cartoony type uh, style of art like this you know the more detail you you get um, you'll get more areas with open spaces um, and you know not all the enclosed shapes you'll get more hatching which will complicate things and so the more you know detailed it is you know the the more this uh, technique won't work. Um, but if you have something that's slightly simple, you know, this is a technique you can do to speed up the flatting process. So, anyways, I hope this video helps, and I'll see you next time.